Hey guys, XNinja here. Welcome to episode 75 of Surviving Minecraft. Last episode, I was looking for mushrooms, and to be honest, I did find some, and I did plant them in the back, so now I have a lot of mushrooms. And the reason why I was looking for mushrooms was because the uh, little villager person was like, my, my child is sick, and he, she or he or can't eat or whatever. So I planted the mushroom plants and I made them grow with, oh, I hear a skelly. But I made it grow with some bone meal and all that worked out pretty well. So now we can make some mushroom soup for Miss What's-Her-Face because she doesn't know how to take care. Whoa, what the hell are you guys doing? What are you building? You're getting really close to my house. Like, really close. What are you doing? Oh, man. All right, well... We're just gonna make some mushroom soup. I think this is how you make a bowl. Yeah, we'll make four bowls. And, we'll, well, we might as well put all of our bowls in mushrooms. And that's how you make mushroom stew. And, uh, what shall I get rid of? I'll get rid of this. And something seems to be wrong with my recording. With my audacity. It doesn't seem to be, uh, recording at this, like... At the same volume it normally does, although it might not sound any different for you guys since I'll just like turn it up later, but I don't know. It's, uh, I'm pretty weirded out by it. Also, the new versions of Minecraft, uh, I think it's at 1.2.3, the full release. I tried updating my uh, Millionaire mod and everything else that I have, the mod loader, all that. And it doesn't, uh, it keeps crashing on me. I don't know why. I think I'm installing it wrong. But I just decided to keep it uh, at the old version until I figure it out. And that's all fine and dandy. I don't really think, you know, it really matters that much. Hello. 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 I want to see what these guys are going to be done building now. I need to, you know, hurry up and give you this mushroom soup. Lady. Do you have the sick child? No, you don't. Who has the sick child? Sick child! I need to give you some soup. 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 Hello. Do you know where the lady with the sick child is? Hello? No. Hello? No. Sick child? No, you don't have any sick child. Who has a sick child? I think you do, Mr. Builder Lady, but you're building like, uh, like a maniac right now. Oh, you just fell. And you're somehow going to get back up there? Or no, you're just going to keep building. Let's look at it from upstairs. Oh, my goodness. She is building a butthole or something. I don't even know. Mushrooms. And there's my money. My money. We'll put this in here, too. All right. Well... Since she is working on that, we can just uh, do something else, I guess. What shall we do? We, sh we shall go feed our cows. Since uh, I want uh, lots of food. Oh, I... No, you guys, get over here. One, two, that's all I have. I don't have any more. I probably need some more wheat. I probably should make a farm. Someone actually told me that I'm always looking for wheat. And I should definitely make a farm, but I'm pretty lazy. And I could just steal the wheat from the village people. Hello, I can steal your wheat. Let me steal your wheat. Stop bouncing up and down, you damn flaming idiot. Alright, I'll take your wheat. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I stole your shit, son. I stole it. Oh, hey, you're, uh, yeah, I just stole those. Yeah, I stole those. Oh, oh, look, I'm fucking up your crops. Oh, ho, ho, oh, what you gonna do? What you gonna do, man? What you gonna do? Can't do shit. I run this town, you see? I run it. You better recognize, man. Recognize. Shut up, cow. Give me your steak. Hello, sheep. Oh, there's a zombie in there. Oh, I didn't know you guys like, uh, like freaking around with zombies. Jeez. Well, he is burning. So where is that lady with the sick child? What happened? Is is Are they not sick anymore or what? You still building? Like, seriously? I think I need to eat. And this big-ass wall in front of my house, you're, like, challenging my house. You, you want to go? My house is bigger than all your houses, you bums. 
Oh, look, you just fell again. You yeah, bum. Bum lady bum. Okay, you need more cobblestone. And none of you seem to have a sick child, so I guess, you know, they got instantly better or something. So we'll just put the soup in uh, in this box for the time being. And we will, I will, I figured out that you could actually, I don't have a workbench in here. God dang it. Okay, well, there's a new achievement. Whoop the friggin' do. Alright, I learned you could repair or just add. See, it's like a little broken and there's a little more health durability on this iron pickaxe. And I found that out recently, but I never really did anything with it. So I guess that's really cool. I never knew you could do that. I saw someone do it and I was like, whoa, that's amazing. And then I did it and I was like, whoa, I am amazing. So what we're going to do for now... I don't have any sand. No, no sand. I have five. I have five pieces of sand. And a lot of stone. I'll just stick that in there. Alright. Well, what we are going to do is I'm we are we we, you, me, I, everyone else in this viewing party. We are gonna go to our little mine shaft over here, see what's going on. Hopefully I can get some cobble. If not, I can just get some from right over there, because I think I am at the point where I need... Oh, some slimes! Slimes! Hey, Mr. Slimes! Oh, and there's a skeleton in there. I don't appreciate that, Mr. Skelly. I do not appreciate it. And look, he can see me from all the way down there. I wish I had a bow in there. Oh, yes, I do. Bow and arrow achieved, but I don't think I'll be able to kill him with just two arrows. Bang! And bang! Yeah, not not doing good. Ow! Fuck! Ow! Split up, Jelly! There you go. You guys can't hurt me, I don't think. Yep. So what level are we at? We are at 30... Oh, fuck! You guys are dangerous. Get out of here. Eh. Eh. Okay, you're the tiny ones that can't hurt me. Alright, so we're at level 39. And this this is indeed the level that I need to make um, glass, the glass uh, uh, floor. So I don't think I can get any cobblestone from this place. So what we're going to do... Hey, you're, you're climbing the ladder. You guys are going to suicide yourselves. Get out of here. Fusho da. Come on, stop. Fuck off. Okay. Trying to go, have fun jumping around and stuff, all that. Alright, well, uh, we are not able to get any cobble. Actually, we could if I kill all the slimes, and then I just dug out this, like, area. But I don't really feel like it. So what we are going to do is we're going to go over here to this little patch of, uh, of stone and just gather up some stone. Really quick, maybe until I break this thingamajig, this iron pickaxe. Hopefully we can find something of use besides just this stone, because we will need it for something, I don't know. Why not? Who cares? Who cares? And, uh, like I said before, I will try to update my Minecraft and my mods you know it's very difficult sometimes i don't i don't even know why mods break or why it breaks the minecraft so it's hard to fix them when i don't know why they're broken in the first place although i feel like it always happens and i honestly don't like it when minecraft updates because that means i have to update my mods whatever they might be and especially with millionaire it's it's not difficult to install an updated mod but sometimes it just breaks and it makes me sad and especially with millionaire an npc village mod it makes it very frustrating when uh, I install the mod and it gets broken and poopish scopodopolis and all that. I don't even understand why it has to break. Why can't it just be happy for me? You know, I just want it to be happy. That's all I want. That's all I really want in life is just to be happy. I just want to be happy forever. Is that so much to ask for? I don't think so. So, you know, you could just 
give me your happiness forever. All right? That's all I want. I just want to be happy forever. That's it. That's all I want. And, you know, maybe a million dollars, but that's that's besides the point. If I'm happy, I don't need a million dollars, you know. Unless uh, the million dollars can make me happy, then by all means, give me a million dollars. What would you even do with a million dollars? I mean, I guess I know what I'd do. I'd buy everything I'd ever want, pay for... Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Fuck off. Pay for, uh... You know, expenses, my family's bills, all that, debts, and all that, debts, debts, dips. In the depths of the debts of the debts, we owe a lot of money, because that's America. You, is there a zombie in my house? I hear one. I hear a zombie. Or is he, like, underneath this area? Alright, well, he's probably inside the ground somewhere. But yeah, I'd pay off all the bills... There's a spider in the thingamajig. I'd buy everything I'd ever want. Probably buy a new house. And then I'd save most of it. But I'd only save it to spend it later. You know, you know, you can't just keep spending money all day. You gotta you gotta prepare for the future. You gotta prepare for the future. So I'd save it just in case we'd run out of money in the future. And oh, oh fuck. Sit down, Dave. No, Dave! No! Dave! Oh! Oh shit, Dave! Dave, get inside. It's dangerous out here. Eat that, Dave. Sit down. Sit down. There you go. Shut up, cows! Shut up. Alright, shut up. I'm trying to commentate. Alright. I don't need you in my business. And where is that zombie? Is he? Oh, you're inside my house. Why, hello. I see Dave let you in, but I don't really want you in here, and Dave is an awful person for doing that. Alright. Well, we could just put some torches. I'll just put a lot. I'll put a lot. I'll put all of these torches. There you are. Fantastic. Let's go to bed. Alright. My, uh, my room here is pretty empty, actually. Besides this chest, there's not really much in here. I still have these Norman leggings as well. Oh, uh, oh well. I mean, we can just deal with it later, I guess. And, yeah, alright. Well, we don't have too much cobble. That lady who had the sick kid, her kid's not sick anymore, pisses me off. Because I got that mushroom soup for the sick lady, kid, thing person and they're not even sick they don't even appreciate me and I don't understand why so fuck off spider I don't need your bullshit right now sir alright so what we're gonna do is I'll take the shovel and we're gonna get some sand get some sand really quick so that I can obviously make some glass do all that good stuff for the little mine area. And thank you. Thank you very much. And I'm just trying to go over here. And I just gotta go over. Oh god, the sand. Sand is so precious. I need it. I need it. Whoop. And I'll take this. Thank you very much, world. This is my sand. This is my sand. Nobody else can have it. This is mine. Oh no, the water. <laughs> Alright, well, it's all fine and dandy. I'll just dig all this crap up, and there we go, and yes, alright, now I will consume the sand, consume, delicious, oh yes, I remember when I went to the beach once, and I was a very little kid, and for lunch, it was a field trip because it was like the end of the year. And we all went to the beach. It was like an elementary school. And I was a little kid and I had a Lunchable for lunch. What'd you, what'd you think of that? Oh my god, a Lunchable for lunch? That's chaos. That is madness. Who would ever thought of such a thing to have a Lunchable for lunch? But if you don't know what a Lunchable is and oh, some coal and water. It is basically... A tiny packaged lunch that has things. It's like, um, I don't know what it's really made of. It's like I had a pizza Lunchable, and it comes with, like, 
these discs of pizza or bread that is technically the pizza bread and then it comes with like uh, the pizza sauce, cheese, maybe pepperoni depending on which one you get and a drink or no no drink depending on which one you get so I was uh, I was eating this at the beach and I was sad because sand had gotten into it and it pretty much tasted like I was eating the sand and I was like this is gross I'm not eating this and I shoved it in the sand I'm just kidding I just put it somewhere I don't even remember and you know I always go to the beach when I was a kid I would always go to the beach and the, the pretty much the one thing I would do would, would be try to make a sand castle and then try to make a moat around the sand castle and then when that didn't work I would just dig a big hole I would dig a big hole I'd, I'd spend hours as long you know how long however long we were at the beach for I'd spend the rest of that time trying to dig a hole as deep as I could and you know <laughs> looking back at it now it's the holes are actually dangerous man I mean if you if you run on the beach and a little kid like me has dug let's say a four foot deep hole and you don't see it then you're probably gonna fall in it and maybe like twist your ankle or something so yeah that's not really the smartest thing to do but it is pretty fun digging a big hole at the beach you know we had these cool shovels too my mom bought this shovel that was like this really big shovel it was like a real shovel it was not like a play play plastic shovel thing well it was plastic but it was big it was a real big plastic shovel <laughs> oh yes all right well what are we going to do now so I have the sand it's cooking up I I got these uh, little little wheat things I'm gonna make some more pigs have the sexy times and uh, you guys can go ahead and make some more babies I'll be over here go ahead and I will take the wood we'll make some more fences as well actually I have plenty of fences I will I'm gonna bust down this wall I don't have an axe fantastic why not who needs an axe when I got my hands? Alright, well, where is like the, I think around here is good. This is a good place to pop a big hole. Actually, I probably did not need to punch the top wood. Only the uh, bottom wood, really. And then put that there. Get rid of this here. Boom. And this one as well. Shazam. And where shall I put it? Shall I put it? The door. I actually need to do make another door. And I'll probably just put it outside like this. And put the wood right here. The, the reason why I did that is because it like closes off the glass here. And if you just put the door. Actually I should. I need to do this too. And if you only have it, uh, if you, if I had the door here, there'd be like a gap in the glass, and like uh, skeletons could shoot me through it, and it's not, not fun, not fun at all. So I'll just do that. All right. Well, yeah. And as for the fences, I will just extend it. Uh, should I go out there? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'll do it off screen, but for now, I just want to do this. I'll probably make a gate too. I probably should not have put that here. And there we go. Do 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 do. All right. Well, that is that. Now to make a gate. If you didn't know, this is how you make a gate. You need your sticks, okay? And you need to put sticks in the middle. Then you put the wood, well not the sticks in the middle, you put it on the side, then you put the wood in the middle, and that's how you make a gate, although I'm pretty sure most of you knew that already, unless you didn't, then that's uh, fine, that's fine as well, actually this is a problem, because if the cows are smart enough, they can jump on here and jump out, but I don't really think they're that smart, so they're pretty dang stupid. So I'll just take this junk out, and you guys have more space to run around and be stupid, so that every time I come outside to my porch, I won't have to, um, you know, get bombarded in the face when I feed you guys. Get out of here. 
Stay. Stay outside. There you go. Alright. So, oops. So, whoops. Oh my goodness. So, what are we gonna do now? I have the glass cooking. I'll take it very much. Thank you. Yes. Should sizzle. Should dance. Should damn. Dang diesel. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Alright, and this is why I wanted the back door, so I could easily go back here, go back to my mine, even though I had to open, like, two doors. It's all fine, I can just do that. And are the slimes still down there? I think so, I think I'll have to kill them all. Uh, I probably should have made an iron sword instead of wasting my diamond one. But I think I have, like, ten diamonds, so it's, it's good. I have some to spare. So we'll just kill all those guys off. Oh, I hear some crazy noises. And we'll dig all this out. There's a zombie somewhere. We'll dig all this junk out. Making progress, my friends. Progress? Progress? P-R-O-G-R-S. Progress. <laughs> yes, we're doing good things. Having lots of fun. Hope you are enjoying my commentary, even though I'm not really talking about much. Yeah, just a little, just a couple stories about my childhood here and there. You know, you gotta, you gotta let the subscribers know who they're talking to, who they're listening to. Actually, you can't really talk to me since I'm talking to myself, and you would not be able to respond. So that was not enough glass. I need eight. Nine more? Alright, well, I could save that for later. We'll just all do this later. It's pretty much getting nighttime right now. I'm pretty sure, unless it's not, then I'm just a liar. I'm just a liar saying things to get attention and whatnot. And it's uh, sort of sort of late afternoon-ish. I don't know. But what do I have in here that's important? I have bones, and I'll take the arrows. That seems fine. All right. Well, for now, we are just going to go back over here. Going out here. I'm I'm going to make all this bone meal, and I'm going to go to your farm and steal all your stuff. Although I am using my own bone meal to make it grow, so you guys should be thanking me for making your poop grow and stealing it after later. Yeah, huh? Yeah. And I don't have any room for this wheat. Alright, there it goes. Alright, well, yeah. There. And, wow, you have like three or four kids? Jeez. Jeez, you're a baby-making machine. Oh my god. Get out of here, you guys. They're baby-making machines. Alright. Well, what is in here? Is, uh, baby cows and the sheep are still in here? Don't really need the sheep anymore. They could just sit there and die or do whatever they want. Okay, well. It seems as if the village is growing ever larger and whatnot, so. We're just gonna sell it the rest of my cobble that I have. Just 43, not much at all. So, next episode, what we're gonna do is we are probably gonna work on the mine down there because we haven't really gotten ma many resources from it all all the resources I have are from like other stuff like I got this from other stuff but yeah I should probably smelt the rest of the iron okay and uh, yeah so we're going to go check out some other stuff I don't know we're gonna go work on the mine get some cobble sell it to the people and then they're going to build a bunch of crazy junk. I wish they built it with regular stone, because cobble doesn't really look that great. Yeah, and they're getting really close to my house. So, make sure to leave a like and a good comment. And until my next video, I will see you guys later. Thanks for watching.